Hello, welcome to uh, this preview game. Let's see what we've got that's new. Swamp Shacks, we saw that in the last game. Um, Stowaway, have not seen that one yet. At the start of your turn, plus two cards. When anyone gains a duration card, you may play this from your hand. And Tools, we saw that yesterday, gain a card. Maelstrom, we saw that yesterday. Shy, we saw that in the previous game. So a lot of new cards here um, to, uh, to play with. We can take a look at what's going on. Uh, Maelstrom is probably not necessary. Tools probably not necessary. I'm interested by Stowaway just to get one in play, and then when I start gaining barges, I can play them, and it, if my opponent has like 5-2 and wants to open with a barge, why would they do that? Why would they want to open with a barge? All right, I think I've sold myself on Swamp Shack's Forager because it helps set up a Maelstrom potentially. Um, yeah, that's terrible. That opening makes no sense. Town Forager. Town Forager makes much more sense. Okay, so we trash a state here. Hopefully next turn we draw the town and hit five. And I guess we grab the stowaway now. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see how to get my audio settings so they can hear me on Discord. Um, very stimulating conversation here. Um, so. Voice and video, input volume. Hello. Hello. Hmm. Discord is telling me that it is recording my video. Okay, so here we take coins by, and I think I'm going to grab a sculptor. Um, the fact that they have these stowaways already makes me want to. Uh, Although, they didn't grab one yet. So they don't have a stowaway in hand. Maybe I do just gain the barge then, before they have a chance to to do that. Okay. Uh, and we're going to take a sculptor now, for sure. And hopefully they, uh, they gain a barge here. Nope. Um... The shy, oh, the shy pile is stowaway. Duh. Uh, I thought the shy pile was always swamp shacks for some reason. Um, I just played another stowaway then. Stowaways are good with shy and good with uh, barge and villages and stuff, and everything seems good there. It lets them activate their stowaways, I guess, but then they've got more stowaways. So we'll trash one of you. Oh, I should have, duh. Um, take town, card action, put the stowaway in play next turn. I'm a little bit annoyed not to have, I'm a little bit annoyed that I have to buy a barge here and activate their their guys, but, oh, they didn't, didn't, didn't find it, so. Okay. Pardon me while I futz with, uh, while I futz with settings in my Discord. Okay. Um, cool, I can react with my stowaway. Yeah, potentially if I draw the stow another stowaway, we just want to keep gaining towns. Uh, I guess we do plus three cards now, and then play the other one for action. <coughs> Could have tried to kick up do a maelstrom there, but we've got the overlapping bards. 
I, I feel like we just have everything going in our favor here. Um, this could be like tools stowaway maybe. Tools lets us gain more more payload, more fives. The stowaways we should be able to get into play pretty likely, pretty often. Okay, so we'll start with barge, and then we'll do shy. Okay, I think this is probably fine. We do next turn on this, play the stowaway, and then tools can gain another barge, which may activate their stowaways. And then we go ahead and we buy the spices that we wanted to buy for the money. Activate both of these. This card plus card. So many towns. So swamp shacks actually start to become useful here potentially, um, given that we have so many durations coming in. Um, and consider also just gaining another stowaway, but I don't think I want to activate their, their draw for nothing. So maybe I will gain a Swamp Shacks. Play that for the actions. Trash of Copper. Take that for Coins Buy. Next turn, next turn. Uh, what? Why did I use a Coffer? Unclear. Okay, so this turn I think we're just going to get, um, we kind of do need to get a barge this turn. One imagines? I don't know. I think we'll be fine without a barge. So we'll get uh, spices, like two spices and a sculptor. With all of this duration draw, we should be able to find stuff to activate our, uh, our swamps. see how that goes. Okay. I am back in Discord. Um, we'll start with Shy and then card action. Alright, so Sculptor going to gain another Swamp Shack, perhaps. Um, if Sculptor gains a Stowaway, actually, I get two Stowaways. I get a bunch of Stowaways into play, right? That's cool. They get a bunch of Stowaways into play, too. But then, like, Swamp Shacks just draws a ton of cards. Uh, card action. Um, Sculptor could even gain another... Another Stowaway. And then put them both in... Oh, Sculptor getting Stowaways puts them all into play. Oops, let me fix that order. I want to play the Forger first to trash a Copper. Okay. Uh, how do I move Maelstrom? Uh, Maelstrom is stuck over my screen. Let us try re... Uh, re connecting here. 
Okay, so that's 12. Um, I'm drawing like a huge amount of cards next turn. I can probably pile stowaways. So I just take like spices and another spices and another spices and another spices and uh, province for good measure. And I'm starting the turn by drawing 10 cards. So I feel fairly comfortable that I will find a village and I've just got a ton of money now and I can pile out spices and stowaways and estates or something, um, probably. So I've just been able to ramp up my payload really quickly here. Um, due to my Discord issues, I was not tracking as much what my opponent was doing. So we'll see. Uh, we'll see what's going on. Tools is also nice, gets me an extra spices at the end. Um, I can play all my barges potentially for actions. Forger gets me something. Uh, and this Swamp Shacks is going to be pretty nice to card action. So that drops me two. Mm, I guess I'll play one of these now. Card action. Uh, okay. So. We're gonna gain one Swamp Shack now, which we play. Uh, gain a Stowaway, which we play. Uh, next turn, next turn. And that's 19. I can gain the Spices. Uh, that gets me 19 Coffers. So I get the three Spices. And uh, it doesn't quite get me, I think, to tripling. So I'm just going to take like double province here and be lame. Um, but that's like the fastest kind of way out of out of this game, I think. Uh, we're having chat about uh, initial expectations. Yeah, I mean, sculptor sculptor really is strong with with stowaway here. Uh, so. Sculptor is strong with Stowaway because you just play Sculptor and then put the Stowaway immediately into play, and then you can play all of your other Stowaways, as we saw. I didn't really pick up on that uh, my first really time playing with Stowaway here. And obviously we have this other other duration card, Barge. Um, so this is what my opponent opened. What, they opened Forger, Forger. It gets you thin faster, but there's so much draw here. We don't really need to thin that fast. So I think the Forger Forger play makes it extremely unlikely to hit five, which is what we're seeing. Tools is quite nice, sort of long term, because I can just keep gaining spices as I green, and it's just a four cost. Um, so I think Tools is was a little bit underrated by Wandering Winter in his initial analysis of, of the set. Just because the ability to keep adding pieces as you green without having to spend much effort on it. Um, and it's non-terminal, so like if you have golds, if you're doing money, spices obviously is quite good. Okay, so card action, card action. I guess we just grab some estates and, and look for the three pile here. Um, card action. All right, we'll draw with that, we'll draw with that. This should be more than enough to to pile out the estates, and probably we could have piled out something else as well. But uh, that is a fun fun win with stowaway stuff. Uh, so glad to uh, get a win there. Let's see if I can exit this game. It does not appear that Steph wants me to exit the game, so it looks like I am disconnected. Possibly because I disconnected in the middle of the game. Although I'm back at the table, so that maybe is an issue uh, updated with the latest version of the of the software. Um, gonna stop here and move on to the next game.